Hello, happy audiobook Wednesday, ACX Wednesday, where I'm going to answer the question Can anyone really be an audiobook narrator? Well, I say that if you like audiobooks and you like to read out loud and you're a good reader, then yeah, you can be an audiobook narrator. But if you're not winning auditions on ACX or other platforms, it may be because you don't have a website. And if you don't have a simple portfolio website that just showcases what you can do, it's going to cut you out of a lot of work. So in this video, I'm going to show you some sample websites that are really, really, really easy to create for next to zero money, and it will just get you started. These are not websites that you want to have for the rest of your life, for the rest of your career, but they're definitely websites to get you started into audiobook narration and into making money. So here we go. All righty. So you do need a website. And in your ACX profile, you are going to want to make sure that you have your website notated in your profile next to your beautiful picture. And if you don't have a beautiful picture of yourself, a photo, go ahead and get one. Get the best represent get get the best photo that represents you the best um, up on ACX. Um, so you do, are going to need a photo. If you can't spend money on the photo, that's okay. Just make sure that you have a, a, the best photo you possibly can, and you will need a website. So um, here's an example of a very simple website that probably didn't cost a whole lot of money and does its job. Um, if you're brand new on ACX and you really haven't made a whole lot of money, um, you can get websites for free with Wix, W-I-X, and some other just, you know, basic website programs that are out there that are for free. Now, the free websites you don't want to stay with forever. It's just to get you started. And the website is basically a portfolio or a showcase of what you can do. So let's look at this first one right here. And this is a Wix website. Um, the name of this narrator is Jane de la Benfell. I actually don't know how to say her name. And I don't know Jane, but I'm really impressed that she has a website. I think it's awesome. So good for you, Jane. Um, and in her, her website, she's got some links where we can click to hear a sample of her narrating some different books. It's really important for you to have a website. Authors need to be able to listen to what you can do. They've got your audition that you've you know, presented to them, but you've also got to have something else that they can see to know that they can trust you with their audiobook. Remember, authors have spent a lot of time writing the, their book. And if they're going to go ahead and spend the money and have a narrator narrate an audiobook, they want it to sound good. So they do want to hear some proof that you can do a good job with their book. And that is just, you know, with samples of stuff that you've narrated. So um, Jane has a couple of these. And, you know, notice they're not buttons. They're just links. And this actually is fine for in the beginning. As you get moving, as you make some money, you're going to want to make a nicer, more professional looking website. But this is fine for the beginning. It's better to have this. And I actually was just doing a search on ACX. And I just did uh, narrators who are available. And really, like out of 100 that I looked at, just a handful even had a website. So just creating a website with just some samples like this that's on, on Jane's page will put you ahead of the competition, I promise. So, um, you know, audiobook narrating, it's not for the faint of heart. It's not just like, oh, I just do it. I just get some crappy microphone and start making money. You're going to have to put some effort into this, and having a website is really important. Let me show you another example of a website that will work when you first get started, and this is um, Celestia voiceovers. And it's just a portfolio. I'm not sure how she made it, but um, just here's just like links 
from obviously books that she has not narrated professionally that she's probably not been paid to, to do, but it's just, these are just samples so we can hear what it sounds like. All right. And this is totally 100% fine. Um, you want to make sure you do have a website. Um, and I've got some other videos that you can watch about how to um, present your samples on your ACX profile and some other videos that show how to, um, you know, just have a have a good eye-catching profile. Uh, check that out in the playlist that I'll have at the very end of this video. If you are maybe not making money on ACX, maybe it's time to join a community of like-minded voice actors who want to make money doing voiceovers on ACX or doing audiobooks. And um, the name of this community is called A VO's Journey. And I've got a link in the description where you can go and find out more information about that. It's just a series of classes. We meet every single week and it's five live classes every single week. One of those classes is a dedicated audiobook course and it's taught by my friend Angela. And it's, it's great. You're going to learn so much. Um, you know, Investing in a website, even if it's a free website, just investing the time to actually make it is really important. And um, once you're kind of getting going and maybe if you have some extra money, just investing a certain very, very minimal amount a month into um, courses will really, really help you grow as a voice actor. And that's what this is all about. You know, I want you to make money. I want you to be able to support your family and to make a living wage off of this. It's a great career. I got started on voiceovers on ACX, and I know that you can too. So um, thank you so much for watching. Be sure and like and subscribe to my channel for more great, relevant, valuable content. Have a wonderful day. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye.